All right, making a lot of progress here at the cabin. Got this whole section back here pretty much done. Still need to trim it out and put up some shelves inside, but uh, that's a job for another day. Got the desk in over here. It's a little junky, but I don't have a whole lot of surface space. But what I want to work on today is I want to build a little broom closet and it'll be between these two joists right here and it'll come all the way down so it'll be loft to floor and I want the bottom about to right here to be a broom closet because uh, my broom will fit in that and then the top I want to put a couple of shelves in and use it as a food pantry. Right now, that's my food pantry. So, I think we can do better than that. So that's what I want to work on today, so let's get to it. All right, I just got those set up there. So I need to pull them down and uh, nail them together. I just wanted to do a sanity check, make sure that everything was cut right length. Looks like it is.
All right, I've got the frame in. Everything's plumb and level, shelves are level. So, uh, and same distance all the way from the top to the bottom. So now I need to uh, start adding my siding. All right, now that I've got 
all the siding done on this side I want to put my piece of trim in the corner but I've got this switch plate right here or receptacle plate so I either have to route out this gouge this all out to match this or I can get my multi-tool and slice this plate and then slip this in. I think I'm going to go with that route because I think it'll look better and it'll be a lot easier. Okay, I'm just going to take uh, some leftover slats, cut them to size, use those as shelves. Alright, there's my three shelves. So with those in, I'm going to go ahead and finish installing the siding on here.
All right, I was able to get my food pantry slash broom closet framed, sided, shelved, three shelves, sided on both sides. Got to decide what I want to do about trim here because I'm not sure that I want to put a piece of trim there. And the reason is because now that I've got this here, I've got this little cubby hole here that I want to turn into a clothes closet. So I want to build a little bench above my batteries and electrical and all of that. So that will kind of isolate that and then everything from there up I want to be a clothes closet so I'm not sure if adding some trim there will interfere with some shelving and uh, hanger rods and that kind of thing so I'm gonna hold off on that until after I get this laid out all my shelves in then I'll come back and trim it so I think this is gonna do it for uh, today's video so I'll talk to you guys later